Hello guys and welcome back for another mod review. Today we're going to be looking at the Ponce Scorpion and Wood Chipper version 1.0. Uh, this is basically the Scorpion and a Wood Chipper combined. Um, the difference being that the Scorpion now has a fifth wheel so you can attach it right to the back and power it from this. Now there's another variation of this too. This is the Crusher actually. Now, I'm going to take you over to the shop so we can take a look. Mods. Forestry. Okay, this was what comes in the mod. Three, there's three different things here. There's two wood chippers and the actual scorpion itself. So, this here is the Flegel Crusher. Big Crusher. It's almost $200,000 in the shop. Maintenance fee, $254 a day. Uh, it needs a lot of power to power that, but this is just the, the right amount. Look at that. Oh, guys, sorry about that. I'm looking at the wrong thing here. Okay, that's $100 a day, but it costs $190,000 to buy. This guy here costs $150,000, $120 a day maintenance fee, and it holds 80,000 liters. This guy holds 80,000 liters, too. It just doesn't say it right here. And 190000 for the Scorpion Ponce. I don't know what the CSAL stands for. Um, not really too sure, but uh, Ponce CSAL tree harvester with a fifth wheel hitch to haul the wood chipper. Yeah, exactly. Now, the file size for this is 125 megabytes, and like I said, guys, these three things are in that one download, so just throw them in and away you go. Uh, yeah, the files. What did I say? The file size was. What the hell did I write it? There, 125 megabytes for this. And it, was there anything else? Yes, I, there was something I wanted to tell you about the Scorpion. Uh, this now can cut one to 15 meter lengths. One to 15 meter lengths. It was. Uh, they raised it quite a bit. So that is really good. And those things hold 80,000 liters, so that's excellent. Okay, enough gabbing. Let's get on with it. So, jump inside, and I'll, I'm just going to bring these up here. And we'll get started. Get this guy to test, crawling at a whole 14 kilometers an hour. So you can see up ahead, I already have my uh, semi with a tipper attached and my other pawns wood chipper that's the chipper up ahead this is the crusher now honestly i like this guy better because he has a nice little basket there that you can put it in with a uh with a uh like a treadmill type thing that hauls it back towards that and just does a great job this thing here is a little bit harder to handle than this but some prefer this instead. Now this here, you can use the scorpion to, uh, you know, cut the pieces and put it on the ground. Then you can use the uh, the boom there to pick it up, the yellow boom. It looks great with the uh, on the semi there. It looks really cool. Okay, now I I don't want to do. I want to show you the other one first. Hold on. Let's detach from this for a minute. I want to put. I want to save that one for after this one. You know what I mean. Okay, let's attach, unattach you. Oh, jeez, I keep pushing the wrong button, guys. Sorry about that. Get you out of the way, sir. Go park in the corn over here. Then we can uh, jump back in you get set up here. Okay. Yeah, this is a great mod, guys. I didn't know there was three pieces to it. I thought it was just two, actually. But, uh... Okay, we're attached. Now, you'll notice that this scorpion has support feet on it as well as that. So, you'll have to, uh... Especially the back part, you'll have to make sure that's supported before you're able to turn it on. So keep that in mind. Ok, 
Okay, let's put this baby to the test. Okay, first things first. First things first. I have to switch over to the back and... No, not that. And get this out of the way. I don't want that dangling in the way. Oh. I don't really want that dangling in the way. Let's keep it right there, sir. Switch back to him. Let's go up here. The support feet down, but it's just kind of awkward in the front because I've got to press Alt because I don't have this program on my gamepad. Left Alt and gamepad now. I can see the feet come out. Alright, now let's switch back to the other change tools and we'll put this guy's support feet down. Oh, this guy doesn't have support feet. My bad. Oh, yes, he does. Is that it on the back there? Who's that part of this? I don't even know. Let's see if we can turn it on. Yes, that's the main thing. I went to get rid of my keyboard there, guys. Sorry about that. And we'll cut this guy down. Okay, we're still on him. Open sesame. I should have a little closer, actually, but... No matter, we can maneuver. Yeah, everything's on, ready to go. Let's bring this boy, bad boy back a bit. Wrap up. Come up, and down. Okay, I hope I can do this now. Uh, let's push it up a little bit, and maybe back the other way, just a tad. Just want to make sure you land on that. Maybe there. What do you think, guys? Uh, definitely more than one. Let's go with a oh, let's go with a three meter length. Yeah, let's try that. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Huge. So there you go. You don't even have to use that if you can line everything up. Nice. And these guys hold a lot. These this actually the tip, the storage on this thing in the back there holds more than your tipper can. 80,000 liters, so... Alright. Look at that, guys. No problem. No problem. You gonna go in there? Okay, I know one thing. I just... I don't like the feet on this. I don't like having to press Alt 9. It couldn't be more awkward. Just because I don't have it in my gamepad, I wish it was an easier button to get to, you know what I mean? Okay, anyway, left Gavin, let's go get another one. Oh, I gotta drive backwards. Close that so I don't have to drive backwards. And look, that thing went in. Nice. I'm gonna try one more, and then we'll go try the other one. How hard is this going to be, I guess? On there, no. I messed up here, guys. Some of these pines get right in the way. Yes. Jeez, it's horrible. I'm usually not this slow. And I always gotta get it as low as I can because of my OCD. 
No support feet. Look, guys, I'm not I'm not setting a very good safety standard here, am I? Oh well. Especially when I drag this tree across the cockpit here. <laughs> yeah. I think I'd be fired. Um, let's lift you up a bit. Let's take you back the other way, just a touch. Okay, let's see if that works. We got it? We got it. In there. Nice. So this thing doesn't ha handle half bad. I like it. Oh, are you going to get in there? Oh, do the flip-flop. Now that might throw everything off. Watch. Yeah. All right, all right. See, that's what we get for showing off. Get the mishmash. Come on, get in there. Look at this. You ignorant. You ignorant. Ignoramus. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Let's get rid of this guy. Lock him up. Show you the crusher. The crusher crushes. Yeah. Oh, I just hit it there. Damn it. Yeah, buddy. Uh, that did this mod up. He uh, painted everything, color coordinated everything. So it does. It looks great. Great job. Fantastic job. Okay, let's get this bad boy over here. So this thing looks pretty cool. I, I like that the. Uh, People are so uh, creative, man, I tell you. They're always thinking, man, they're always thinking. Alright. Let's back you up just a touch. No. No, that's fine. Okay, let's, uh, move around. Okay, no, no. There we go. Let the back up a little bit. I'm a little too close, I think. See, ah. Uh. Okay. Okay, hold on. Okay, why won't that work? I'm trying to turn on the crusher. Okay, hold on a sec. Oh, God. I forgot that you have to have the legs down on this guy. Sorry, sorry, guys. Yeah, this guy, you gotta have the legs down to operate. I told you that at the beginning, and I forgot. Oh, no, no, no. Don't mind my foolishness. Okay, now open up. I was wondering, because every time I open the teeth on this thing, they close back up. You're not gonna let me get... Stop, 
excuses, excuses, eh? Get in there. Chop up. See, it's a little... I shouldn't be as picky with this one, because there's kind of a bin there that they'll fall into, right? Look at that. So, obviously, it's going to take a while to, uh... to fill that. We're only at 5%. But, I mean, that was only one tree, too, so... I shouldn't be dragging with the support feet down, but I'm just cheating for the review. Just move things along. Let's do one more tree, guys. And I'll go over this review and see if there's anything I forgot. Oh yeah, let's look at the inside of this. Check it out. Wow. I never looked at the inside of this before. Wow. That looks fucking awesome. I like that. Everything's really gold looking, isn't it? That's fucking cool, man. I ever cut at this angle. And you can see why. <laughs> no, you never know until you try, right? I suppose. Oh, well, it's definitely. Okay, I'm reverse driving too. Now, I think I'll jump out for now. Oh, and then there's this view. Yeah, right, right, right. No, I'm gonna go to this view. Everything's reversed here for some reason. Is it on there? Yeah, it is. Okay. Choppy, choppy. Choppy. Oh, you're falling the wrong way, dude. Oh, Jesus. That would fall in the weird direction. Hmm. I'm going to have to try to get closer there. Perfect. I hope you guys can hear me over that thing. I know those uh, wood chippers can tend to be pretty noisy. Look at that, guys. Quick way to make some wood chips, man, let me tell you. Now, is there anything I'm forgetting to tell you? So, there you go, guys. The Pont Scorpion and Wood Chipper version 1.0. Pretty good indeed. What happened there? Okay, I jumped out before it had a chance to crush it off. And the wood chipper. What's this? This is the Gens CSAL. If anybody knows what that is, type it down below in the comments. I'd be curious to know myself. Gens CSAL chipper, this is. And this thing gets the job done too. If you can maneuver the scorpion, this is just as good, really. You know, it holds the same amount, so. There you have it, guys. Until next time, happy farming.